Hi, this is Dan Lyons and welcome to this tutorial on how to use the levelator, which is really going to help even out all of your levels for your podcast. Well, to start off with, I'm in Adobe Audition. It's basically a really high-end version of Audacity Audio Editor. And what I want to do here is just record a little quick audio file talking different volumes or different amplitudes so that uh, it's a really good example of how the levelator can fix all that. So I'm just going to hit record here. As I hit record, I'm talking right now at quite a good level. And now I'm talking at quite a lower level. Hopefully, the levelator, when it actually processes this audio file, is going to be able to uh, make the audio even and at one level. Okay, so that's exactly what I wanted to do. Just to give you an example, okay, this is a pretty decent level here. This is a quiet level. So imagine these are two voices. That would be you talking, that's your guest, you and your guest. So that's a real problem at the end of the day if that's your audio file because it's going to be an absolute pest for whoever is listening to your podcast to be constantly turning it up when the guest is talking and turning it down when you're talking. So this is where the levelator comes into things. So let's save this file and I'll show you how quick and how effective the levelator is at evening out your sound levels. So here we are back on my dock. I have my audio file over here saved to my desktop. It's called Untitled One. Now it's a WAV file. It's very important that you save your audio as a WAV file before you throw it into Levelator. Because a WAV file is an uncompressed file, which means, well, basically what it means is you're going to have a much better quality than you are an MP3 file. Now here's the thing. When you're about to stick an audio file into Levelator, it does not take mp3 files because they have already been compressed so make sure your original raw audio file or your source audio file is saved as a dot wav file okay so we click on levelator and here it is this is the interface really it's uh, very basic as you can see now it says that we can drop and drag a wave or ai f file so that's okay you can save as an ai f as well so we click our untitled file we pull it over to the levelator window and we let it go and we can see there that it's just done it's processed it exactly like that now the actual file will end up being saved in the same place that uh, you saved the original file so let's go back to audition and have a look at the waveform and see if levelator really has made much of a difference so here we are back in audition remember this file this is the one that we recorded earlier as i hit record i'm talking right now at quite a good level and now i'm talking at quite a lower level okay so that was the original file wasn't too good we decided so we stuck it in the levelator now let's go into the file that was processed by levelator now same thing but it's just levelator has processed this file and evened out all the audio in it let's have a quick listen to this as i hit record i'm talking right now at quite a good level and now i'm talking at quite a lower level Hopefully, the levelator, when it actually processes this audio file, is going to be able to uh, make the audio even and at one level. Okay, so I'm pretty happy with that. So that basically is how the levelator works. Now, using the levelator isn't a good excuse not to check your levels before you start recording, but certainly if you didn't do a great job or there was an issue with the software and you have this file and you've got all these peaks and valleys and you don't know what to do with yourself the levelator bit of software is fantastic and it's free and it works on pc and mac thanks so much for watching this video tutorial today and if you haven't already and you'd like some more hot tips and tricks on podcasting and audio please subscribe to my email newsletter you can find that at how to make podcasts like a pro.com